proceed with the eviction. It's Halloween, a time for thrills and chills for children of all ages, but what could be more frightening for a youngster at any time of year than the prospect of facing surgery? Nancy Lou joins us now with details and someone who tries to make that better. Nancy. Yeah. Harry and Bertha, for many children, the prospect of undergoing surgery is much scarier than any Halloween ghost or goblin. That's because children may not understand exactly what's going to happen to them at the hospital. Well, you might say that one doctor has set out to blow such fears away. Perhaps you would never guess that five-year-old Christopher Kralik is about to undergo surgery. His spirits are inflated because he's already undergone a visit with Dr. Ballou. Chris, you know, this is the kidney and this is the ureter, and you have a blockage right at this point over here. Perry Gerard spends now most of his time as a radiologist at Maimonides Hospital, but he spends the rest of his time as Dr. Balloon. If a doctor draws out something on a piece of paper, and says, this is what I'm going to do to you. I found that a lot of people just don't understand. Not only children, but adults, too, don't understand that. After his mishap on some stairs, Christopher now understands that his balloon bladder and his real one will soon be well again. The area is going to be open, so the blockage will be totally gone, and you won't have any more problems at all. Okay? It showed exactly, you know, you could see it. It's more clearer than on a piece of paper. Doctors say it's clear that kids who understand their surgeries seem to recover faster. Dr. Balloon says he can demonstrate absolutely every medical procedure in order for patients of all ages to understand. In fact, many adults are put at ease with this demonstration of an angiogram. Well, we do again, Dr. Balloon shows patients how a catheter is inserted to open up clogged arteries. Another common request of Dr. Balloon is the demonstration of an appendicitis. But if you take a balloon and you show them a three-dimensional object, it makes things so much clearer. And not only that, you put a smile on a person's face because who doesn't love a balloon? So far, Perry Gerard seems to be the only doctor in the country using balloons to demonstrate surgical procedures. The benefits are so great, he's hoping that other doctors will learn to perform balloon surgery, too. Perry and Bertha. That makes a lot of sense because right. it gives it that third dimension. Right, yeah. right. And a lot of